I say like smooth ass, like smooth ass rap, like chill rap, you know what I'm saying? Like I'll say real rap, but like vibey rap, I say like Tulsa got that going stupid, like going smash, you already know, like all of them got that going crazy. Um, and like people like Grand National, you know what I'm saying? Like they kind of like bounce back and forth from Tulsa, you know what I'm saying? So it's kind of like that sound has a bridge from Oklahoma to Tulsa, oh, okay, see the Tulsa, you know what I'm saying? And like they got like a kind of consistent groove, you feel me? And that's like a dope sound. That's like a more mature, you know what I'm saying, sound rap wise, mm -hmm. like mature. Um, and then here, honestly, people don't even know about it, but like our indie sound, like, is fire. Like, you ever heard Thunder Jackson before? Nah. Bro, Thunder Jackson, he that boy. Like, and my boy, um, High Volume Beats, he is, um, he's his, like, keyboard players in his band, like, his tour band and shit. But, like, Thunder Jackson is super fire. Like, just a crazy different kind of music, like, a different kind of music, you know what I'm saying? But I just feel like Oklahoma gotta come with a different sound, the most different sound that I've heard just different in terms of like different and like easy to receive Buddha like for street music you know what I'm saying for trap shit like he a good example like he's, his trap music is really good you know what I'm saying he encompasses a lot of different things and he embodies like a lot of what Oklahoma is you know what I'm saying shout out to Buddha ADHD um like I said smooth rap like I personally this is my opinion you know what I'm saying it wasn't all my opinion but like I don't like street singing bro Okay. I don't like it, bro. Yeah. Like, it's just like, just because musically here, you know what I'm saying? Like, back to roots is like not that. Yeah. If that makes sense, you know what I'm saying? Like Louisiana, you know what I'm saying? They sound like that for a reason. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Like their environment. Like that's that's they grew up on that bluesy. You know what I'm saying? But even they kind of talk like that a little bit, like drawing their words out. Exactly. Shit. You know what I'm saying? All that, all that is. You know what I'm saying? That's that's important. That's just like the identity of people. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. Like the identity of them. Like that's in their soul. Like I recorded him in You know what I'm saying? I worked with him and like he sang and it sounded like a old. You know what I'm saying? Prohibition. Black dude with a guitar just bailing his heart out, you know what I'm saying? He's singing right next to me like this. I'm like, I look back at him like, what the fuck? I didn't expect that shit, you know what I'm saying? But it's like, that's just their identity. And there's a lot of artists from that area that have similar qualities, you know what I'm saying? You're like, okay, that makes sense. So, I don't know. I just feel like here, we ain't, that's a new sound. You know what I'm saying? People are adapting that sound. Yeah. That's kind of fresh. Like, if you look at any past music you know what i'm saying it didn't sound like that you know what i'm saying that's just like it's different um i don't personally don't think that it's like the music that's gonna be the identity of where we from just because you know what i'm saying life is a little different you know what i'm saying for people